Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Virag here with InVideo and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I created an epic product commercial for Hershey's milkshake without having to shoot any footage. The only things we will need is some things that we can find on their website and a super easy to use online editor. Well, I'm pretty sure at this point you guys are thinking, is this even possible? Well, let me show you how. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is actually hop on to Hershey's website. I'm in the section where it's all about the milkshakes. So these are the products that I want to be covering in my commercial that I create. The first thing I'm going to do is scroll down, go to every single flavor that they have and download the image. So I can just right click and save image as. The reason I'm downloading every single image is because these are the images we're going to be using in our commercial to introduce every single flavor. So I can go ahead and do that for all the five flavors available. Another thing that we can see is actually a description given for every single product. So let's say for the chocolate one, it says refresh in the most deliciously chocolatey way. The almond flavor that will leave you craving for more. Love the sweet flavor of strawberries. So by reading all of this, you all can understand the entire product revolves around the feeling of getting refreshed in a really delicious way, in a tasty way. So we need to make sure that we use these elements and tonalities in our commercial to make sure that the product is described accurately. Another thing that we need to notice is the font that they are using for their products and for their website as a font plays a really important role in the entire packaging and the entire feel of the product so I'm just gonna go ahead and keep this in mind but once we are done downloading all the images and understanding the entire element of the brand and the product it's finally time that we hop on to end video I'm gonna go ahead click on blank canvas as we want to be creating the entire product from scratch we're going to be choosing the white 16 by 9 and make a video. And video is going to load up a timeline for me. Now, just to save up some time, I have already uploaded all the required images for this edit. So you all can see every single product, the company's logo, also a collage of all the products together. Keep in mind, all these photos are PNG, so they're transparent files. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is actually find the right music for my commercial. So I can go to the left-hand side panel and click on music. And video has a huge library of royalty-free music. So you can use them for your videos freely without having issues of copyright. So I think for this commercial, we could experiment with hip-hop. I'm gonna go ahead and listen to some tracks. As this product is extremely vibrant, upbeat, refreshing, we want something fun, we want something upbeat, we don't want something boring. Uh, that's the entire tone I'm going for. I think that's the perfect track for our video. So I'm gonna go ahead, press the plus icon. NVIDIA is gonna add the song to the timeline. The reason for me to choose this music is because it has a lot of beats. So I can make sure that every single cut of the visuals happens on the beat. This just gives a more appealing look to the entire video. Now it's finally time that we can start lining up our clips. Now I'm gonna go head to the video section on the left hand side panel. NVIDIA has a huge library of royalty free stock footage as well, which is extremely high res. You can simply go ahead, search things over here and it will show you the most relevant results. I think for the first search, I'm gonna go for something simple. Let's just type milkshake. I think this video I really like. It's just a simple footage of the bubbling milkshake. I think that triggers the exact emotion that we want to give out with this commercial. So I'm just gonna crop out the clip a little bit. Go ahead, add it to my timeline. For the next section, I think we can go ahead and search chocolate splash. As chocolate is one of the flavors that they offer in the milkshake, a nice chocolate splash, nice orange background, looks really, really nice. Now in a similar manner, I can go ahead, find some more relevant stock footage, which will add to the entire vibe of the video. And I'm gonna line them up for the first initial few seconds. As you don't wanna jump into showing the main product right at the start, we just wanna hype it up a little bit so that the audience is eager to watch what's coming up. So I'm gonna go ahead, line up the stock footages, and I'll see you guys after that. Okay guys, so after spending a little bit of time finding the right stock footage, this is what we have come up with so far. Okay, so far pretty simple, just four clips attached together, cut on beat. Also make sure to understand that the stock footage that I have chosen for the video is very relevant to the brand and its entire mood and theme. So after this, it's finally time that we get into the main product, introducing them. So let's go to the folders where I have everything imported. I think I'm gonna start off with the strawberry packaging. So it looks something like this. Now increase the size a little bit, make sure it's in the center. Okay, so we just can't have the packaging like this. We need to spice it up a little bit, add some layers to it, add some visuals to it. So I can simply click on the layer which is my photo I can go to animate and now I can give an in transition so I can choose which one I want I have a bunch of options to choose from but one of my favorites is the fade and I'm gonna fade from right so that's gonna I think that looks really really nice so I'm gonna go ahead go to the video section on the left hand side panel let's search for strawberries flying I think I really like this one I think that look really nice go ahead add it we can actually go ahead and place this under the packaging so now it's gonna look something like this 
Another thing that we could do to actually step this up is add the word strawberry behind the packaging, just a text coming. This would actually help in driving the viewer's attention straight to the flavor. You can go ahead, click on the text on the left hand side panel. I'm gonna go ahead, add a heading. Now I hope you guys remember me talking about how important font plays a role in the entire commercial. So we need to make sure that the font matches the Hershey's font as closely as possible. So I'm gonna go ahead, select it. Click font over here and NVIDIA has a bunch of different fonts that you can choose from. So let's see which one looks like Hershey's. I think this one over here looks extremely, extremely nice. I can also go ahead and make sure that it's big enough. And as I said, I want the text to be appearing behind the packaging. So I can simply drag this layer under my image and there you go, there you have it. Another thing that we could do to make this much better is change the font color. So I can go ahead, make it a little light pink because that is what would look best with the flavor so this looks extremely nice and one final touch would be adding a shadow so i can click on the shadow color over here enable shadow and a simple black shadow should look extremely neat so now when i play this back this is what it looks like i think that looks extremely nice but another thing that we could do to make this slightly better is add an animation to the text as right now it just comes as a slow fade which does not really go with the entire theme and the entire upbeat vibe of the commercial. So I'm gonna go ahead, select the layer, animate. And for this particular one, I think I have one transition in my head, which is one of my personal favorites, which is called the Disco Station. I'm gonna go ahead, add it to the in. And now when we play it back. Wow, I think that looks very, very nice. One final touch would be actually adding a cinema scope. These are basically the black bars and top and bottom of the video. This simply makes your entire commercial look cinematic as a whole. So a very simple trick. I have downloaded a PNG from Google. You can easily find it. Now we want these cinema black bars to be there for the entirety of the video. So I'm going to take the top layer, make sure that it's covering all the footages so far. And I'm going to lock this layer so that we don't mess around with it by mistake. So in a similar fashion, I'm going to do this for every single flavor, finding the right background video, adding the right text, the right color, the right theme. Also add a little bit of text in the start of the video so that the viewers have a little bit of reference when the commercial starts. But you guys don't need to sit with me for the entire process. You all can simply go ahead and enjoy the final product that we created today using these simple tricks. But with this guys, we come to an end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something out of this. Let me know in the comments below what you would like me to cover next as I'll be covering one new product every single week. But with this, this is Virag with video and I'll see you guys in the next one.